and Pete reporting back. What's up, guys? So, it's Sunday. It's the weekend. And I went riding with uh, some of my friends. We went to a place called Terracotta Park. And then we did a bunch of stuff. But my friend Mike, he has a lot of classic BMXs. He, like, collects them. Kind of obsessed, but it's really freaking cool. So he showed up today at Kev's place, and as soon as the doorbell rang, I'm like, I gotta see what this guy has, okay? Um, I don't have, I didn't put the footage in. I filmed a, a bike he had that I wanna show you guys. But anyways, he showed up with a Hutch Trickstar. It looks like this. The Hutch Trickstar. A classic. With a Dominator seat, the worst. The double bars. So cool. And it's it's like from 1984. It's old. And those double bars, I don't know what they were thinking. Back in the day, they used to do a lot of bar rides. And I think people were putting their feet in there. And anyways, it's crazy. Old school BMX bikes are so freaking cool. And they're not cheap. That bike... <coughs> that bike's definitely worth a couple of grand. Anyway, so we went to Terracotta Park, and I filmed it on my GoPro, and it's on 1080, so this video might be, might take a long time to, to, to upload, but you don't guys don't give a fuck about that. You'll just know when it's uploaded. And it went like this. Welcome to the forest, my friends. Let's go. Let's Whoa. go find ourselves a leprechaun. <laughs> Where are we, in England? I mean, in Ireland? Ugh. <sighs> Nice. Mike's bike, the Trickstar from 1984. Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, fuck. <laughs> well. I almost clipped that guy by accident. There's an ah, oh, there was an opposite trail there. Opposite trail. We came here yesterday, but not here. It's raining. Oh, cool. Go over the bridge. Look at big rocks down there. Oh my god. Cool. I don't know how much battery life I have on this GoPro, but... I hope I'm filming in 720, not 1080. Back there with the stream and everything else. Yeah, it is. I didn't think it was this It's big. a shitty day, but it's raining. A ton of work in here. The last time I was here was like just wood thing. And go. Here we go. This is actually a lot higher than it looks. 
That was lame. At best. Go. Higher. go. That wasn't bad. Kevin. Cool. So then, then we went to go get drinks, and we went down this big hill. It's crazy. Um, it's it's a it's in a, a mall like you're gonna see. And then there was like a literally a hole in the wall pizza place. It's crazy, watch this, plaza. And there's all these people closing up. And then there's a, literally a hole in the wall. It's Louis Fritz Pizza and puts in. It's just a hole in the wall. That's so funny. There's the Topaz bar. Oh God, my friend, son of a British shop. They have all kinds of cool drinks and stuff. They just bought one of these. Ones. That's a fruit punch like that. They have a pop shop. Got all kinds of cool stuff in here. Candies. It's almost like bulk barn. They even have beers. Wow. You don't see places like this around. They even have combos. It's a poop emoji. Yeah. Combos in Montreal. Very cool. Yeah, so I love stores like that. They had combos. I know where to get combos now. That's amazing. Um, I bought a fruit punch drink, like I said in the video, and it was okay. And it said all Britain, all British stuff. But it was really like the drink I got was from Mexico, but maybe it's popular in Britain? I don't know. I love stores like that. They're really cool. So that's about it. Um, yeah, don't forget to subscribe immediately if not sooner. And uh, like the video, thumbs up the video. And I'll see you again soon. I have a video about a chocolate bar that I want to try, that I've never tried. And I asked my friends about it and they're like, I don't think they have that in Canada, but it's at the store. So it's at the store that I go to. So we're going to see. So anyways, that's it. Have a good night. Have a good week if you're working. I'm not. God knows if I'm ever going back to work. Bye! Oh, God. <laughs>